Hello and welcome back to Railway Empire. We're sat at Wagga Wagga staring at the camp that we have to turn into a city today. Among others, we have the settlement's window open. As you can see, we've got about 30,000, a little under, towards our next permit. We have a couple, don't we? Two, I think, of the five we need. So... For the next few episodes, it's going to be a little different. We are going to be expanding, expanding, and expanding. <laughs> yes, a lot of expansion. So we're going to hit play. We're not really in any rush at the moment. Let's take a look at our tasks. We have established zero of five. We have until 1885. That won't necessarily get us a gold tick, though. And that's what it's all about lately. We have Aubrey to hook up. Um, but we should maybe think about delivering there. We have a logging camp there. I just realised that might have been better for uh, Wagga Wagga there. I've been reliably informed in the comments as well. You can just say Wagga. I'm just going to call it its full name. We still have this settlement here that we uh, need to unlock as well. Uh, Junie, what are we going to start with? You'll notice we've got a cross down here. No suitable freight. It's the one heading to Sydney from the logging camp and the reason being is we haven't upgraded it and to upgrade it would cost us 400,000 so there's not much we can do about it at the moment I'd rather overstock than understock what we can do though is leave that there as a reminder because we do want to upgrade pretty much all of our industries now last episode we didn't have a recap on our on our earnings and if you look down here it was correctly pointed out that we were on a bit of a decline. It tends to line up with us expanding. That's probably what that is. We've got an issue here. We will take a security guard. This is the uh, the mine run. We could probably shorten it and send it down here. However, it's begging to have a maintenance yard somewhere along the way. Probably a couple. So we'll think about doing that as well. We have lots to do though. Should we get uh, these guys growing? I think what we want to do is get these connected and bridge the gap from Allen Chopping to uh, Wagga Wagga with an intermediate station because we do want to sort out all of our passenger lines. This is going to be a meat factory. So that'll be lovely. They are going to be both meat factories as that's the closest. It will be a little silly trying to drag grain all the way over there. Let's get you up and running. We don't have to cross the river immediately. And it would be a, a pretty bad idea as well as would hit those contours there as soon as we got across. Did that not click? Clicky. Here we go. We'll use this inside one to head to the logging camp. And that one's probably okay. I might actually go for that one though with the possibility of running a bypass straight into uh, Wagga Wagga. Let's tidy this up then. Well, that's nice, isn't it? 47 mile journey. It doesn't look like 47 miles, <laughs> but it is. Have I connected these wrong? That's a great start, Grand. I don't know what you're doing there. Uh, you almost had a good idea and then you didn't. So we have our connection there. Next stop will be Wagga Wagga. And then we might even be able to use the, the logging from both sides. Now this one's going to take a little turn and then we'll head in to the outside because we might have four tracks here. We should be able to get it fairly nice if we head down a little bit. There we go. 1% and 0%. We'll get these in nice and fast. We are playing the waiting on the funds game, but we are building uh, lasting structures here. I am waiting patiently to unlock a few of the industry projects that are hidden away up in our research. Or well, not just industry, all buildings. We have one that will help us buy things like stations and industries. Even cheaper than we already do. Okay, we can't afford to buy trains yet. Talking of research, this is brilliant timing. Uh, we can't afford that, I'm afraid. What do we want to unlock? There's another freight train here. It's obviously going to be a lot more expensive. It can haul a lot. I don't think we're really worrying about freight trains struggling at the moment. We could probably make do with a 
the 10 wheeler we've got. I wouldn't mind unlocking this and then going around our passenger lines. I would like to put all three you know, wagons on our passenger trains. What do we need to do? We need to deliver lots of stuff to these guys. We can make a little branch line, couldn't we? Down here. And we don't we don't even have to cross the river here. So we are going to save a little bit of cash on not having to bridge across. We want to come in before the grab that water tower. Well, our money's going up quick again, isn't it? I do like that. It's fun once you get to this point in the game. I think what we could do is have a water tower or supply tower just there as well. So it's off the line. We're probably going to rework this as well once we get Juni set up. It's on a bit of a hill, though. So it could be a bit tricky. We do have the stocks here. So what we can do is get that running. Let's get them turned into a city, shall we? Now, the reason I wanted the, the bold wings is because it, it's going to be cheaper for us. Orange, they have enough beer stocks for us. Hopefully, it won't take us too long to save up for the trains there as well. This is, this is us now for the next. Oh, Aubrey dwindles. Bear with us, Aubrey. <laughs> we'll get you growing again. But yeah, we're going to be doing a lot of this. It's all about map population now to get us our permits as fast as possible. And the best way to do that is not only create new settlements when they're available, but to also increase the size of our existing cities. Obviously, money's tight. We blew through that 4 million we gained, didn't we? Pretty quickly. But uh, I think it'll pay off for us. I do. I'm confident. Right, we have a, a whole bunch of trains <laughs> heading down there now. Now, we should do this as well. Do we have enough logs there? We did have a problem last time out. Yeah, we've got plenty. So we can set that up as well. Is that a connection bonus? I think it was, wasn't it? That would be lovely. Bit of free cash. Take that. Right, get you running. And in fact, don't duplicate it. Let's take advantage of this 417,000 just to put in a temporary station there. And just connect it up like so. Here we go. Now we've got some funds, guys. We can start expanding faster. Right, where's our where's our train? There you are. We'll duplicate you. Soon we're going to have to start thinking about adding some trains running from the warehouse as well as the logging camp there. We already have grain up this end, so we don't really need to worry about this one down here, and that can go to the coast. How are we doing? We are getting stores. Right, we can use those. Yes, we can use those straight away. It's not a bad journey, is it? We need to sell some of these trains as well. We are going to be doing that, but we've got the funds at the moment. Right, who's on the way back and empty? You. I love setting up these new settlements because you'll notice your money gets really low because you're buying trains one after the other. A total of eight if you want to do it as quickly as possible. And then, of course, you get the refund for them. So it's absolutely perfect. Is that you on the way back? Yep, you're done. Get rid of you. Where's the rest of our trains? There's another one done. Look at our money go up. It goes up so fast. And then we'll move on to a Echuca. It just sounds like I'm sneezing. I'm terrible at pronunciations. I don't think I need to remind you. Okay, is that everybody? What else do we have? We're waiting on fish. Uh, seafood, not fish. And logs. Logs should be almost there. Where are our seafood trains they're both there and they're both full so we'll sit down here back where we started but this time they've got a lot of goods in store here we go here comes our logging train chief engineer oh maybe we can get some green ticks that would be lovely right delete you I will sell you back. I'm not just deleting it, am I? <laughs> we could look at it as though they're temporarily being uh, put in storage in a depot of some sort um, because they're not going to be needed early on in the settlement's growth or the city's growth. 
Should we check on this chief engineer? Uh, that does some interesting things. We still have two green arrows. I've been calling them ticks, haven't I? That's because I'm getting carried away with the whole gold tick situation. So everything's a tick now. Uh, right. Green and red arrows. There we go. The arrows. Definitely arrows. Who does that make happy? It would make out... Well, depends what you... Were you helping the same as our current chief engineer? How does that change things? Well, it neutralizes that one, doesn't it? There. He still stays unhappy, which is a, a shame. Currently, he's really... I, I like it. Guys, we're going for this guy. Because he's getting two red ticks this way. No one's getting two red ticks. There we go. Now we've got 7% on him. Oh, that's beautiful. We're finally tidying up our office situation. It's a little better, shall we say. I guess while they're doing that, let's sort out one of our crosses. Currently, there is no cross because every now and again, they're going to require the logs. Now they're definitely going to require it. We might even need to... Orange grows. We might need to even expand it. The uh, deliveries. Okay, what else do we need to do? We probably need more than one train delivering. Yeah, because that's going to take them forever to deliver that. So let's go into the fisheries here. How much to buy it? Ooh, nope. <laughs> Absolutely not. Soon we're going to get rid of all this. Well, we're not going to get rid of them. We're going to assign them positions on our trains. Market Crier. Do you know, given the size of our network now, I think that will be a good idea for us. Getting uh, increased profits from an ever-growing passenger service. Do we have passenger trains from here? I'd like to set up one. Uh, I don't think we do, do we? No, we don't. Right. Let's have one running from Armadale to, yeah, Port Macquarie, then Newcastle, then back again. There we go, that's lovely. And we'll have you as passengers and mail only. It's about time we had a new passenger service. Uh, Rogers American is our fastest express currently. You don't need a security guard though. You do need a conductor, so we'll get you on. And a stoker as well. Yeah, indifferent. Uh, ooh, green tick. <laughs> arrow, Grand. It's an arrow. <laughs> oh dear. But there we go. We got that on, and we can do this. We're going to put mail car, caboose, and dining car. Most of the time, these are never full, so you, you can make a bit of extra cash doing that. Right, we've got 200 points to spend. Do we want the freight? Kind of. It's going to be pricey. What does it do, though? It unlocks this. Oh, I should have noticed that earlier. Oh, well, that's a... That's a no-brainer, isn't it? Reduce the purchase price of new locos. 15% huge. This is what we've got. We're, we're really getting into the consumption territory now, aren't we? And maintenance requirements. The reliability is creeping up, though. But look at that tractive power and acceleration. Oh, it's a beast. <laughs> I love it. I like that train a lot. Right, security guard. Yes, you're going to be needed very shortly. And another one. All right. Get on board. Where are our trains? Let's hide all the gubbins. Have they already gone back? Where are you? Have you gone back already? I've lost them, guys. Oh, they are on the way back. Goodness me. Right, get rid of you. And get rid of you. Perfect. We don't mind them breaking down. We do need a maintenance yard or building on there we get an influx of staff again it's great to see though we do need them and now we have to think about making you a real station and begin to set up some lines to get you growing what's the first thing we need uh, to buy your industry otherwise you'll build all together now weave in factory every time right every time but you're not you're gonna do meat there we go. Meat factory on there. Aubrey's not going to budge at the moment. We need to set up the, the cattle. We're definitely going to upgrade all of the stations. And stick maintenance yards on there. Currently it goes via Alan, Ch Alan 
chopping. But that's going to change very shortly. We also need to set this up. We still own this. This would be a better one for us, I think, coming down into Ballarat and Melbourne. I think what we'll do there is head up through the mountain. Uh, now that bridging is cheaper and uh, tunneling is cheaper. Should we check the research? Is there a better tunneling? I think there is. It's like, uh, is it this one? No, that's auctions. This one with the dynamite. Nitroglycerin. Oh, please. That's beautiful. That was this one back here. So we just gained 4% across the board on all of our freight. That's absolutely amazing. This one's going to be key before we do that connection. Engineer. Absolutely. You're all going to get a place to live very shortly. Oh, can we get it now? Oh, no. We need to unlock that train. Oh, that's typical. That's fine, though. Cheaper trains. Perfect. How are we doing? Are we getting close to another permit? Not really. Understandable. We haven't really set anything up. So let's get the... No, stop trying to offer me that. Is that that? Where is it? It's out in the middle of nowhere. Uh, if you're wondering, what is it? Oil. Uh, let's go to somewhere where we can... Yeah, no, that'll be fine. Let's go and see where oil is required. I can't see it. It's right down the list, isn't it? No demand. It's also an industry. So, yeah, we're not going to need that for the longest time. So, a bit of waste of money. And we'll probably just get blackmailed permanently. Which we will, if you don't keep up with uh, their level. So, if you keep leveling something up, you'll likely get blackmailed if you don't do anything about it. We have a connection bonus for Tamworth. Well, you're kind of in an awkward place there. I'll tell you what I would like to do is get you a grain farm or a brewery even. Not a grain farm. You can't build those because grain is just up here. I say just up there. It's miles away. I don't know what you'd be best building. Well, you're kind of surrounded by grain, aren't you? And there's not a cow in sight. There's wood, but that's about equal distance, probably a little closer. Well, no, we could manage that. Yeah, let's give them a brewery. The reason I'm doing it now is because we're going to be setting up a temporary connect. We are. It is going to be temporary. A temporary connection. Oh, no. You know, it shouldn't be temporary, should it? No. Because that will add to our network, which will also add to this. How big are you? That's another 24,000. And they're already a city. And we've just bought the uh, the industry there. So, yes, let's do it, guys. We're going we're gonna to switch our plans a little bit. Get this set up. It's going to be beneficial to us. And we'll get a bonus. How much? Half a million. You'll see we've got a bit of an issue here. To get up to the grain farm. It's it's just it's a nightmare. I'm not entirely sure how we're gonna do it. Do we have any other ones we can unlock around here? Maury. Possibly then. And we got that one over there. <laughs> Nicely avoided, Gran. It wasn't obvious, was it? Oh, I don't know how to best get up here then. We could just connect over this way. We've got a few cities over that way as well, don't we? We have yeah. Oh, I forgot the pronunciation again. I was reading it earlier, and I still forgot. Good job. Do we want to sneak up there? I think that's the worst way to go. Well, there's a little gap, isn't there? But then you've got to make it up this section. Um, think, Graham. This looks pleasant. Or doable. Pleasant's the wrong word. Let's do it. Let's try and go this way. Uh, as long as it's not too bad. Yeah, no, I kind of like this. You can kind of hug around here. And then head up, I'm hoping. Into the back of the grain farm. Would be nice. I mean, I don't... Oh, that's actually pleasant. It's pricey. Granted, because we've got bridges and stuff. But it was nice. So, if need be, we might do it like that. Okay, let's drop the price. 
quite a bit. I'm tempted to do this like this, uh, paying through the nose for it, because of of how much of a refund we're going to get. And it's a, it's a huge journey. We're definitely going to need some sort of uh, maintenance yard on there, aren't we? Halfway. Probably here. Where's the other city? There. Maybe them. Maybe. Uh, so what we want to do is get us... We haven't seen these for a while. We haven't been... Well, we have, but we haven't been using them the most. So if we connect into there, how are we going to do this? Delete that. Start again. We're going to head around here. There we go. There we go. We got it. Bring this up like that. We'll do it in sections. 81k for that one. It won't count as a full connection until we actually hook up into our network. Currently, it's just sitting there all on its lonesome. Now, with this, we can head up this way to the grain farm and also down from there. Uh, right, let's just connect in like we did before. Obviously not like that. That's terrible. And see what we can get. Well, it's pleasant, isn't it? That's nice. Boy, that's... In fact, that's better than what we had before. A little tunnel is absolutely fine. There we go. And we get a refund for the entire lot. I like it, guys. And then we've got a maintenance yard midway. Which I think is going to help as both a junction and for necessary repairs. So we don't have to worry about, about trains that have high consumption. I'm going to say we're going to stick with... A few supply towers thrown in here and there to help out our trains and keep them moving. Right, um, this is ours, which is even better news. Yes, yes, yes. Tamworth is now connected. And I guess we can head that way as well. How do we get across from here? Right, now you're getting distracted. We can have a passenger line, but we'd have to set all that up. They do make beer though, so let's at least do that for them. We'll give them freight only. Uh, we got a new one, don't we? The Mastodon. Mastodon. <laughs> Mastodon? Isn't that a. Uh... Oh, I don't know what that is. Don't even guess, Grand. You'll embarrass yourself. Only 88,000. What does the 10 wheeler go down to? 55,000. Right, get you on there. Let's get some of these people some jobs. Uh, well, not you two, because you falling out before you even got on the train. That would be miserable, wouldn't it, in the little cab? If you both hate each other. <laughs> and you're all in, cramped into the cab. Alright, there goes our train. Do you want to have a look at these? We haven't looked at them on the tracks. There we go. I love these. They're, they're like beefy steam engines. They make me all sorts of happy. They got some speed on them too, haven't they? As it slows down. 50, 50. What do you keep slowing down for? What's up here? You got issues. Well, let's let's not pay too close attention to that because I have no idea what it's doing. So we have a little branch line going out there, and I I feel like direct might be good for the the express because that will be similar to the passenger lines. And then we pay a little more for that later on. So we'll wait on connecting it that way. And that gives us another connection around here. Which will, although be long, will connect into Dubbo there. And then into Orange. That's one thing. Well, for that price, I'm going to say yes, I think. Yeah. That's a late game uh, industry as well. So that's good. That's good value. They're quite pricey otherwise. Okay, we're going to be doing something around here. What do we need to do? We need to, firstly, rework this. I don't think we need to worry about an inventor. They're the ones that take our money from us. You've left that in. Right, it's time to get a Chuka a station. And we'll get this one done as well. And then that's two new cities we've created or founded. You can't do it yet, sir. What are you missing? You're missing an actual station. So we're going to go along parallel with the river. I think that's a good idea because we need to get to uh, Bendigo over there. Bendigo. Bendigo? 
I'm at it again. Right, and there's our connection to direct to the the sawmill. No, not the sawmill, the logging. And then what are we going to do with this? I guess we head this way would be nice. Pretty much similar to how we were before. Um, but we're going to double track it. We don't have to do that though. We could flatten out, or well, not too much, flatten out the curve a touch. Our new trains are not going to worry about it. Don't put another one in, just adjust this one. There we go. 1%, 1%, then 3. Our, uh, our earlier trains would have been pleased with that, wouldn't they? Do you think there's enough, uh, or not enough slope, less of a slope, somewhere around here to have a, a maintenance yard? Because it would act like a junction as well. Or isn't it needed? I mean, we could just branch in like that. That's beautiful, isn't it? Let's just do that then. That gives us access to the grain then. Now. Oh, do you know? We could finally double track this, guys. That wouldn't be bad, would it? If we can. Oh, you're on the wrong side. That's bizarre. What were you thinking there? I guess you weren't. Well, we were kind of leaving it, weren't we? I don't think that's going to let us delete it. I'll tell you what, reset it because I would like to do this while I'm thinking about it. In fact, what would we like to do? We'd like to add a second station into here. That's what we'd like to do, or I would like to do. Uh, just in there so we can go direct to the grain. And then we can start reworking some of our lines as we come across them. I know, we're spending all of our cash. That's tidier, isn't it? Then it's not interfering. Beautiful. We'll have to change where that train goes. It should be okay. Right, get up there. Oh, we've still got a single signal there. Don't want that anymore. Where's our train? Is it going to be broken? Possibly. Is this the one? No, that's to Ballarat. It's this one, isn't it? We haven't upgraded these trains for the longest time. Where are you going? <laughs> where are you going? Oh, I know where he's going. That That's wrong. Don't do that. I tell you what, we'll just delete you. And we'll get a new train on and set up a new line. It's going to go all the way down here. Turn around at Ballarat and then go up into there. We don't want him doing that. That would be a waste. Right, Kelly Manor. It's just the same line. But we're going to put a new train on. We'll put the that one on. We'll get a member of staff back on there. I believe it's the same guy as well. So that's cool. Um, do we need to worry about? Only if they make you happy, I think. Which they don't. What do we got here? Another engineer. Anyone else? Market crier. Yes. Let's go for safety this time. We are setting up more and more lines. It's helping our money. There we go. We've got a train heading into here. I think what I want to do is upgrade this when we can afford it, which is now. The reason being, we can double up on this train uh, because we've got Kelly Manor's quite high. And we'll leave it there, guys. Oh, we need 88,000. I forgot how pricey these things are. Worth it, though. That's what I'm saying. How long is it going to take? A millennia. Apparently. There we go. There we go. Good timing, because he's just on the way back. Get a security guard on there. That's good money, that little run. Good money. Can we get a green arrow? Not tick. Stop saying tick. Get you on there. It's fine. We'll put you on. There we go. There we go. We're going we're gonna to need this. Uh, brewery just here for a selection of towns around here including where are we Chuka there there we go so that's what we're going to do when we come back what are you missing gran well do your signal in first otherwise you will forget i might have broke the train was it on the right side if it isn't i'll be upset it was your own fault let's face it get that up and running Oh, you've done the silly signals. It's fine. It's fine. It doesn't really matter, does it? There we go. Uh, were you on the right side? No. No, you wasn't. Of course you wasn't. 
I mean, you're an old train anyway. You're going to be stuck there. If we... If we delete that signal, what will happen? Will you keep going? Can we delete all of those signals. Just, to, just until he gets by. And give you a new train. There we go. You're not crawling along. I think when we come back, guys, we'll upgrade all of our trains. It's going to make us money faster. It's also going to help our cities grow. We can put these signals back in now. Perfect. Yeah, because there are a lot of slow trains going around our network. In fact, these ones are going to need a supply tower, aren't they? That's not good. There we go. What do we have? Yeah, look at them all. What have we got on here? They are the Dunham. Yeah, these have not been upgraded in forever. Let's get another one on there then. Oh, you don't even have a security guard. Guess what? We've got a couple. I was going to say a load. But we don't. It's going to be a slow process at the moment of upgrading everything. Green arrow? Red arrow we don't want. You get on there. And we'll do the rest uh, next time out. Oh, let's spend the research points though, right? Because we want this one. So we'll unlock the consolidation B. Take a quick look at it. There we go. Yeah, I'm doing the whistle. Uh, look at the maintenance requirement on that thing. Oh, that's really nice. That might be good for some long journeys. We're going to have to keep an eye on things like that for long journeys. If we see a lot of breakdowns, it might be better to go for reliability over speed. There we go. I think that was productive. So, how much have we got? We got Wagga Wagga. Uh, we're about to set up a Chuka when we come back. That's the first thing we'll do. Uh, we've also connected Tamworth to our network. And that goes up to Stephen's farm. We'll we'll spend a lot of money getting a direct line to Armadale there. And we'll also head this way once we can afford it. Lots to do. Lots to do. It's going to be a case now, going forward, of tidying everything up. Let's not forget a supply tower on here before we go. There we go. What do we want to ride on today then? I mean, we could take a... What are you? Yes, that's, the, that's our new grain trains, isn't it? I'll I'll find us a train. I really want to get on one of the... We will take a security guard. Game's not letting me go. It's always the way, isn't it? Where's all of our trains? Where's our logging trains? We'll find one. They go, like, all around the houses. Oh, this is a good idea. And we might, if we're lucky... And this is a bizarre thing to say. Get stuck behind one of our slower trains. I just think that would be kind of cool. To see it off in the distance and us slowing down at signals. Alright guys, that's been episode 9. I think. Possibly. <laughs> and uh, more cities for us. We're about to do our second one, which will be Ichuka. So that will be 2 of 5. And we're upgrading these. All this original setup. Is that one of the old ones? There we go. We'll see those no more after the next episode. That's what we're going to be doing. Spending a lot of money upgrading them because we have the money now. It's worth it. What are you doing? Are we filling up? Or are we just waiting on our slow train up there? I don't know what we're doing. Are we filling? You're a brand new train. Yeah, we're filling up. All right. Well, they do have high consumption, don't they? Do you think we're going to get a gold tick for this one? Remember it was 1885, we're in 1864. As long as we focus, and as long as we get all of our cities growing, uh, connect anything we can uh, when we see it, and obviously grow our, uh, our settlements up fast. It's all going to count. And until then, take care.